Guys, what's happening? Hey, look, a few years ago, my mother passed away, and um, one of the ideas that uh, that came out of that was a brand called Be Positive With Us. So I, I purchased the domain names BePositiveWithUs.com and BePositiveWith.us. My intention was to create like a positive clothing brand. The whole, whole point being that life is really hard. But, uh, but it's so beautiful. And so, you know, I just had these like quotes and ideas. And what I want to do is just have them on shirts and have people purchase them and create that brand. Uh, the idea kind of fizzled. It died. It went to the bottom of a list. I started doing some things for it. Um, but what has happened is that now I have a, a part time assistant that's helping me with tons of projects. She's doing a great job. And so now this is a business and an idea that I want to bring back to life. So I'm going to walk you through the process of what I'm gonna do for that. All right, guys, so again, welcome. If you are not familiar with print on demand, what it is is basically someone places an order for an item that has been previously designed like a t-shirt, and when that order is placed, one of those items is printed and then mailed to that person. So rather than having to print hundreds of an item, you're just printing one and sending it to that person. So that's print on demand. Well, Amazon has a service for print on demand. Um, and so that's actually what we're going to be using for for Sachin, so for my, my assistant that's helping me with some projects. And so what I want to do is just walk you through kind of what we're going to be doing and kind of the stages that you would need to um, to create in order to, to get there. So the first thing you're going to need to do is go to merch.amazon.com and you're going to need to apply for a merch account with Amazon. Now, currently they're not accepting, it looks like accepting designs due to COVID-19, which is totally understandable. It's just kind of like a warning that's on this website is what it looks like. But so I already have a merch account. I probably sold like five things, give or take. I mean, have not really sold anything, but this is the easiest process to create a print on demand business. Once you've created that account and then you are allowed to submit items and submit submissions. So you're going to need ideas and designs, right? So I had already actually previously, I used Trello for brainstorming. Uh, you can see here, I have a giant list of, of ideas that are already um, can be made into shirts. So you're going to need to brainstorm, you're going to need to brainstorm some ideas. Then you're going to need to create some designs. It's going to be the next step. So what we're going to use, what Sachin is going to use is going to be Canva. So we already have an account set up. The paid version allows for you to do transparent backgrounds, which is pretty amazing. If you're not already using Canva, check it out. I'll put a link down below, but I'm sure you're probably, you've at least heard of it. But the the fact that you can do uh, transparent backgrounds at no cost is really amazing. You can resize images. There's lots of stock photos in the paid account. I think right now it's like $12 a month or something. So I'll just show you an example of what we would pull up. So. So sample transparent. So this would be the something that we could do. And oh, I should also point this out. Now you cannot resize on the uh, free version, but let me give you the dimensions because it's actually pretty important. Artwork dimensions. So artwork dimensions is 40, here it is, 4,500 pixels by 5,400 pixels. I remember the first time I was looking that up. It took me a few times to, uh, to to find that. Now, again, remember, if you have the free version of Canva, you are not going to be able to do this. So that's actually a really cool feature of the uh, the paid version. All right, so basically, you know, knowing the size that that's what it has to be submitted to um, to Amazon Merch. And my, my intention is not to create like complicated designs, but like just positive messages like uh, love people. I don't know, just as an example, right? So then when you have that, you're going to obviously download these designs, PNG, you're going to need a transparent background because that's what you're going to be uploading to uh, Amazon Merch. And again, you have that size of the design that you need. Super important to know. So I'll just save it. I'm not even going to open it because, you know, at the end of the day, it's just a, well, I'll open it, but at the end of the day, it's just a file. Um, 
So that's the design, but it has a transparent background, meaning that the, you know, the background is clear, basically. So uh, that is the current steps for what we're going to do. Then we're going to be looking at, depending on how uh, the Amazon merch program goes, we're going to be looking at selling on Etsy and using the Printful print-on-demand uh, integration into Etsy, which is a separate a separate way, right? Amazon Merch is its own print on demand. Printful is is its another print on demand service that you can integrate in with other um, offers and stores. And so, depending on kind of how we go, I think we'll start with Amazon Merch, and then we'll look at uh, expanding to Printful. So, I'll also I'll put some links down below. If you've never checked out Printful or heard of it, I'll put a link to that to Canva. Um, but yeah, connect with me. So, like, I'm all about living a life of adventure. I think life and life and business is one giant adventure. We only get one shot, you know, so try that thing, try that side hustle, try that unconventional business that you've been thinking about. Get out there and do it. I mean, I'm, I'm here to support you. Comment below. Let me know what um, what you're out there, what you're out there putting together, what you're doing. I'd love to see what your project is and, and support you in, how, in whatever way that I can. So do me a favor, like the video if this gave you some value. Um, I'm going to create a part two as we move forward uh, after Sachin puts these items into motion and I'll create a follow-up video and let you guys know where we are, how we do um, with the designs and like and what this what this looks like for us and we'll um, we'll go from there and hopefully we'll get some positive messages out there with our uh, with our clothing so cool take care guys